Hey, welcome back. It must be Tuesday again. Really glad you're here. Hope you were there at our Branson Collector Car Auction. Uh, April 2021, we had a great time. April 19th, uh, we had a fundraiser reception for Vintage Car Rally Association and their autism programs. We raised thousands of dollars again through the delightful donations of two automobiles, one from the Gullies in, in Arkansas and another one from a gentleman who built a beautiful tea bucket roadster. And we auctioned both of those and a lot of other stuff, raised money for, for uh, Rex and Judy's programs, and we had a really good time. I hope you were there. I hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. Uh, the following days, Friday and Saturday, uh, with the auctions, we did really well. Uh, we finished up at 68.5% uh, sell-through rate. Right now, with our post sales, we're about 69.5%. I think we've sold another three or four cars since the auction was over. Uh, but the, the high points of the sale, of course, were, first of all, that beautiful XK120 Jaguar that used to belong to Mark Trimble. Uh, that sold for 93.5, uh, which was a really good price for it. Uh, then the 37 Packard uh, Street Rod, magnificent car, 82.5, 82,500 on that. 57 Bel Air Convertible, beautiful little car. I mean, it's really, really well done. 69.3, that market has changed drastically. And then my buddy uh, Barry, Barry Williams, sold his uh, 86 328 Ferrari GTS, and he got uh, 67, 67, almost 68,000. And then of course my car, the 41 Cadillac Model 62 Special uh, Convertible. That was a funny story all by itself. Uh, it finally sold, 66,000. But uh, you know, with bidders from Japan and from Germany and from Holland and from Belgium and all of that, what it ended up being was a bidding war between a gentleman in Laguna Niguel, California, and another gentleman in Malibu, California. You just have to know a little bit about California to understand that one. Anyway, the gentleman in Laguna Niguel got it. He's thrilled with it. He actually flew in here prior to the sale and drove the car, so he knew a little bit more about it and I hope he enjoys it as much as I did. It's, it's a beautiful car, wonderful car for touring. It's been a really, really, really busy two weeks, but we're not quitting now. Uh, when you say you sold 70%, around $3 million, that's nice. That means there's 30% that didn't sell. And we continue to pursue those cars or pursue buyers for those cars. And I'd, I'd like to show you a few of them that are still available. Uh, first of all, over here on my left is a 65 MGB GT. Beautiful little car, fresh paint, nice black interior, white piping. When I found out that it didn't sell, I, I was highly disappointed. I, I thought it should have gone on down the road. But if you've got around 15 grand, give me a call, because uh, this car uh, still needs a new home. Now, right next to me is a 67 Austin Healey 3000 Mark III BJ8. This is a nut and bolt restoration. We featured it in uh, a video before the auction. Uh, as I probably said at the time, the owner uh, commissioned the restoration and wanted a no expense spared. Uh, we did that for him. He showed the car. It scored maximum points and now he wants to go on to something else. So he had over 100 invested in it. Initially, he uh, said, Jim, if you can get 100 for it, that's great. And now he's saying, find me a real offer, a serious offer. So that's what we're looking for on the Austin Healey 3000 Mark III that is perfection. Also, this surprised me that it didn't sell because it's priced right. This is a 56 T-Bird, hard top, uh, featured this one in another video prior to the auction. And I just love the colors, this teal blue with the white top, the blue and white interior. It is an automatic and it drives beautifully. Uh, it, you gotta be thinking somewhere in the low 40s for this car. But if it still interests you, uh, it's still available and I'd appreciate a call. 800-335-3000. Uh, 
3063 is our office. And as always, we want to hear your questions and comments and send those to Tuesday at BranstonAuction.com. Uh, we had a great time. I hope you were there to enjoy it with us. For everybody that was, thank you very much. And if you missed it that time, we'll see you in October. Bye now.